All right, good to have you along with us. Friday evening here. It's been a beautiful day for us. Temperatures got up into the 60s after kind of a chilly uh, start to the day. Even a little patchy frost around the area. Live look downtown Temple looking out across Santa Fe Plaza there. We've got fair skies now. But the clouds are going to be really rolling in as we go through the late night hours. We've got a pretty strong south wind rolling in off the Gulf of Mexico. A little disturbance, a, a, a tropical wave, if you will, along the Gulf Coast. This is going to drift northward as we go into the weekend. It's already producing some light showers there in the coastal bend. And as far south as Brownsville and then as far north through Corpus up towards uh, Matagorda Bay, they're seeing a little bit of shower activity. A little bit of rain trying to show up on the radars out around San Antonio as well. Tonight, the clouds and the moisture make their way up. We will see about 20% chance of showers east of I-35, mainly during the afternoon hours on Saturday. Once we get into Saturday night, our rain chances start going up. And as we hit Sunday, they really start ramping up because we've got a front coming through. And that's going to pick up all this moisture that's on the Gulf Coast now, bring it into our area. Not anticipating severe weather, but there could be a couple of rumbles of thunder here and there and uh, additional much needed moisture on the way for us. We're still so very dry, even after the nice rains we had uh, last weekend. 40s across much of the area this evening, back to the north and to the west, to the south and southeast, down to the Brazos Valley. We're closer to around 50 degrees at the airport right now. The skies have clouded up a bit. It's 48, 66% relative humidity. There's that south wind, and it's going to be breezy tonight. As much as 15 to 20 gusts at times right now, it's sustained at 13 miles an hour. Here's the forecast. Increasingly cloudy tonight, breezy, 43 year overnight low. Those winds out of the south, 10 to 15, gusting to better than 20. Tomorrow, probably going to be an overcast sky. Very windy. The wind's picking up out of the south, 10 to 20. The stronger the winds are, the more moisture that's being pulled up that's going to be available for showers. So we'll start out with a 20% chance of rain tomorrow. 65, your maximum reading. Down to 49 Saturday night, Sunday morning. I'm going to go about 30% chance of showers, not storms, the showers through Sunday morning. Then Sunday afternoon, 30% chances of maybe a rumble of thunder. Not everybody's going to get this. Most of this action, again, is going to be east of I-35 because... It's closer to the moisture source, which is the Gulf of Mexico. As that front comes through and stalls out, then our rain chances really start to zoom up uh, Tuesday and Wednesday, where we're looking at 50% chances of rain. I can't promise rain every day to everybody, but exactly. it looks like this. Exactly, because you know how it is, Andy. You say yeah. it's, it's going to rain, and then they say, well, I didn't get any at my house. Well, just, <laughs> you're not holding your mouth right. It's coming exactly. tomorrow. Got to open it up wide. That's uh, it. All right, Andy, thank you, Matt.